Hello guys, I hope you are doing really really well. In today's video, I am going to show you how to get Microsoft Excel for free in Samsung tablets. So guys, the tablet that I am using is Samsung Galaxy Tab S8 Plus. But the method that uh, I will show you uh, will work on all other Samsung tablets. So guys, first of all, you have to open your internet browser and then you have to open a website. Name of the website is excel.new. Okay, so you can see over here excel.new. So you just uh, open this website. Okay, so once you open this website, uh, the Excel will open in front of you uh, with the sheet. Okay, so you can see everything is open now here I can work with all my tools and all features are available over here. Okay, you can edit it, you can put formulas, everything. One more thing I want to mention here is when you open uh, this website excel.new. So if you see this page in front of you, you don't have to worry about you just sign in with your Microsoft account. If you don't have your Microsoft account, you can create one from here by just selecting this create one option and it is completely free you can also put your uh, gmail id or any other id here to create your microsoft account and once you log in with the account it will take you to the excel sheet one more thing i want to mention here is this is an official web version of microsoft excel okay so all your work will be saved into one drive and you have the space of 5 gb so now i will uh, try to enter some values some numbers uh, to check if everything is working perfectly fine so you can see I put numbers over here and then for example I want to put a formula over here so you can see there is a formula tab just select it and then uh, for example I want to insert this sum formula so I select it okay and now it is showing over here and then I press enter so you can see it is giving me the correct result now if you want to download a copy of your work you can also do it simply you have to go over here in this file tab okay and then you see this option of save as so just select it and then you see this option of download a copy so uh, the, uh, the file name is book 11 okay I download a copy of this so you can see it is now downloaded so how to access this simply go to your my files folder so I go into my files folder and here you can see this downloads uh, option over here just select it and you see it is now uh, saved in your uh, download folder so just select it uh, this is book 11 if I select it it is giving me the option to open with office so I just select it in the office and then this will open here uh, you can see this is my work it is saved now I can access it as well so now I open uh, this file again one more thing I want to mention here is whatever work you do it will automatically save into OneDrive so you can see it is showing over here save to OneDrive if I select it so you can see over here by selecting it it is showing me uh, the file name I can give it the file name and location it is showing OneDrive if you want to access this in your OneDrive simply go over here these dots you see just select it and here you see it is giving you the option of OneDrive so just select it if you go to your OneDrive it is showing you all of your files related to Excel over here you can access them from here as well you can also go to the recent tab from here and it will show you your recent work you can see this is my last work over here I can access from here as well and the space available for it is 5 GB okay you can see over here it is also showing you the space over here you can also buy the um, extra storage now if I select uh, this um, uh, Excel sheet from here okay so let's talk about different features so the first uh, feature which is really important is the formula so formula I select this formula tab from here if you select insert function over here it is uh, showing different functions over here so if you select the financial okay it will show you all the financial 
okay so you can see over here then if you uh, go to the uh, VLOOKUP as well lookup and references you can see this is the lookup okay so you can see over here and then if you select all from here okay all so now here you can uh, access all functions from here you can see all functions are available over here okay uh, you can also use the uh, pivot table option so for example if you go to the insert a uh, tab from here the pivot table is over here you can also insert tables you can also insert uh, graphs you can insert the uh, pie charts okay so you can see over here and um, then you can also use the data validation option so you can see if you select this uh, data and then you see this data validation option is also available so all the tools are available over here the next most important thing that I want to mention here is you can also share your work. So you see this uh, share icon over here, just select it and you have two options, share and copy link. So if you select this share option, you can share your live work okay so now here you can insert the name of the person or the email and then you see there are different options. anyone with the link can add it so the other people can also edit it if you don't want to allow editing you can just um, you can just remove this option from here as well so all other option available you can share your work or if you want you can copy the link okay and then that link you can also send it to your friends or with the other um, uh, colleagues okay so you can see you can copy it and then you can also use this link so here is the link available guys if you want to add more sheets okay so you can see from here you can add more sheets this is the plus sign you can see this is the sheet 2 okay uh, with everything new all the tools are available on top so if you want to use your S Pen for writing on your Excel sheet, you can also do it. So you can see over here, there is a draw tab over here. Just select it and once you select, you can see over here, you have different pens option, the highlighter option and the eraser option. So if you select this pen option, you see you have different thickness okay you can change the thickness from here as well and then if you want to write on your sheet with the pen you can write okay you can see okay so you can see over here you can write on your excel sheet uh, if you want to highlight something okay you can highlight it okay so this is the highlighter okay so you can see you can use the highlighter option here as well and you can also use the eraser option so guys this is for today's video please like my video and please subscribe to my channel guys thank you very much